Hello there everyone, welcome back to Sweet Transit. We haven't played this in a little while, so I figured we might as well pick it up and continue with our playthrough. Uh, we are covering quite a bit. I have a few things that I want to do today. We're gearing up for, for diesel, but we're having a lot of trouble with trains around here. So I feel like we have to do something about that first, maybe? I'm not really sure what I would like to do. I almost want to get rid of this this whole thing that we're having right here. Um, and I would like to have a specific passenger space instead. Because now this is kind of a mix between a lot of stuff. And it's slowing down like crazy from these guys. So I would like something that's a little bit more efficient than what this is. And I think what we are going to do, and what I think will be the easiest way to resolve this, would probably be to change this intersection, make that a T that goes in that direction instead. And then do the same right here, so make a T that goes left, and one that goes right, that connects to here. And then just cut off all of this. And just leave the actual warehouse right here. And that way I should be able to, because Minsk can actually grow. So if we look at how big Minsk is, we can grow Minsk quite a bit. Minsk is really big. So what we could do is just get rid of all of this, move this guy closer directly onto this station, and then build this station bigger further out here. I think that's a decent idea because then we can use a a station that has a bridge access instead which I think will be really good so use like a six lane station with bridges for example. I think that would speed up a lot of the travels. So the first thing we need to do if we want to do that then is to get rid of this guy. That is the the first thing that we need to do. So I'm just going to wait for him to get through here and then we will dunk down a different intersection here. Probably even using one of our larger ones. So we have these guys now. Since we have our our uh, new bridges now, we can actually use those. Unfortunately, I actually need to get rid of more of these. So let's let's get rid of more of the, that and then go three-way intersection with steel bridges right there. That is really expensive, but I think that's fine. And this also gives us the opportunity to unlock the larger station that I want to go for. So if we look at these, the passenger stations. We need to produce 120 steel per minute. At the moment we are producing up to 75, so I guess we should make sure that we are we're able to fix that as well. That's 115. That's closer. If you just want to make this like cheap now, you could add another one of these and then add a distribution center. I don't like that solution. So what's the most we can produce now? Limit of 189 and we have... Uh, how much did we need? 120. So that should be enough. If we can get enough workers over here, which is questionable at best. We are really struggling with workers. <laughs> like really bad. Which is unfortunate, but... I guess that kind of is what it is. I wish you could make a copy of these. Would be really nice. Uh, I guess we could do... Let's see, he is going there. So yeah, I guess if I put you there, that should be... that should be pretty good. Do that. And I think these will just continue every second side. And then we'll set this up. Great. 
Great music. Something this game does really good. The atmosphere in it is just fantastic. Uh, okay, so from there we want to have a gap and then continue with our two houses. That's unfortunate that it's becoming uneven like this. Oh wait, are you going to... Why are you just standing like that? Where are you actually going? You're just walking around randomly. Maybe we don't want this then. And then we have enough space now to put one of these in the middle right here. And that should connect to you. Those two, those two. You two. And then we'll just do more or less the same thing right here with the small adjustments. We have a little bit more. Oh, we're running out of bricks, huh? Yeah, we're just not having enough workers at the moment. That's the that's the main issue here. Uh, how did this go? Did we connect everything? I think we did, right? Yeah, that's fine. That is perfectly fine. Okay, that's good. Uh, and then these are going to go... Yeah, the downside to this is that the guys going up here will have to go really far. Actually, not that bad. Pretty alright. That'll be pretty good. Still no... No bricks being delivered. Surely you're full soon. Just these guys, man. They're not doing anything. Just lazy. Okay. Getting some bricks now, at least. So, if we go boom, and then we'll go boom. Should be able to continue here. I like to do two tiles like this, and then if we have space, I'll put in one of those parks as well. If we don't have space, then so be it. That is perfectly fine by me. Uh, I think that's okay. I think that's okay. Here we can go with the same setup as the rest of them. Wow, we are using so much bricks. Surely we should start seeing some more workers now. We have a lot of workers here, actually. It's just that this is being stopped up for way too much. Let's get rid of these, since we're running larger trains here now. I think that just stops a lot of the stuff. Maybe I shouldn't have you running here either. Let's sell him. I need a bunch of steel. Uh, what are you doing? Load that cotton. Uh, load that cotton, Minsk 5, Minsk 1. I think we're gonna have to move. Do I need to upgrade you to get more people to live here? Yeah, our time on all is actually as big as they go. Can I upgrade that in any way? Isn't it G? Uh, is it K? L? J? I don't know. Ah, here it is. My bad. Control F opens that up. So when do I get the next city solution here? City Hall. That is... Quite far in the future, actually. Yeah, we need another... It doesn't matter that we're building out this then. I just realized. Without another city, we can't actually expand anymore. So... That's something to keep in mind, I guess. Um, no matter how much people I build up here, I won't be able to do anymore. Okay, uh, that simplifies our options a little bit at least. So I want to see where we can place... We actually have access to the passenger station now, so that's good. But I want to see where we can actually place these, these guys. So anywhere we have the 
brown dirt, I guess. This looks like a decent place to go. Okay, I could go right here. It'll be a little bit further for them to, to travel. But that should work pretty well. Or should I go in the other direction? What if we go this direction? Build a T right here and bring it up. That's a decent idea. Why don't we do that? Let's build another city over here. Uh, how do you build a city? <laughs> Somewhere in here I think there should be an option to build a city, right? Village hall, yes. And we can also build a town hall. Which is probably what we should do. Let's wait for some, some bricks and then we'll get the town hall going. Because yeah, there's no reason to, li uh, to limit ourselves in any way. And then we're gonna have to build up all of the basics, more or less, for that. It should be fine, because I have oversized everything at this point. So, with maybe some exceptions, we should be able to support ourselves fairly easily just by expanding these these stations that we have. We should have plenty of space to do that. Because yeah, if I build the city over here, I can bring them down and work this part and even some of this if we needed to. And also all of this will be available to be worked. It's more or less just, just this guy and wood that I would really prefer to have to have Minsk deal with. Yeah, I didn't think of that. There's actually a limit on on city halls now, or, or whatever this is. You can't actually go past 17,000 people. Do we have any... There we go. Now he's leaving. So yeah, town hall going down right over here, I guess. Do we want coal inside or outside? Probably outside. But we want to have water. Let's go with you right here once we get the bricks. Doo -doo -doo. Everything else looks really good though. We don't really have any issues other than this. Okay, Yunawa has been established. What happened to our city now? I'm guessing all of you are gonna start complaining about not having... Actually, no. They are not complaining yet about not being able to travel. Okay, that's good. That's good. So, from here we are going to need a... Would kind of like this. Reach a population of 50 craftsmen. <laughs> we can do that. Craftsman's residence. Uh, so if we go like that, I'm just gonna make a circle around where we're gonna have the the City Hall, I was about to say, but the market. And then we'll do that. We'll do this, I think. And then... Like a little bit of asymmetry here. Let's do that. And let's have some craftsmen living here. Okay, that's too much asymmetry. Yeah, that sucks. <laughs> um, how do we get around, around that then? I build both of them close by and then do... That's an interesting idea. What if we do this instead? Do, do. That, and then get rid of these instead. 
So, Craftsman Residences. We are going to do this. No, we're not. Uh, that's as much as we can build. Do we have 50 yet? Yes. Good. So that's your Nava. Upgraded. And then we just need the large warehouse right here, which needs 400 bricks. What's the reach of you? You reach really far. So if I go even further out, that's fine. And I think we're going to build this fairly central. So everything is going to be... Yeah, I'm going to have a road on the back side here. That's my plan. Like that. Same thing on this side. So I want to have a a main road going in between each house, and then I want to have a hedge on the outside. I think that would be really nice. Uh, I guess we should plunk down some storages. Wait, what? No, it's water we're looking for. These guys. So right there. And then we can do you... Can we also get down one of the these guys now? No. We can't see what the reach is now at least. So it looks like we are going to go here. That should be pretty good. And now we have the stuff we need for the market. Almost. There we go. And I guess what makes sense here is to have a storage. Build a small storage. We're probably gonna move over to medium here fairly soon as well. But now that's gonna have to do. Space holds. Space used to hold goods for future use. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, we do need to build a hop farm for that though. And then you will just take from there. All right, so how do we want to connect to this? I think I want uh, Yonava to be producing everything itself. I don't think I want to produce anything anywhere else. What if I do this? It's kind of neat. wonder how it will go. Not actually great, though. That is better, I think. Who built this station? I'm just gonna build it so I can rebuild it. Look at this. This is awful. I wanna have a station that I can use more reliably. I feel like we're missing a few of the smaller stations like this. But if we fix this guy up, then we should be in fairly good condition, I imagine. That should be... That should be good enough. Get rid of these as well, maybe. And then do that instead. That should be... that should be good. That'll do just fine. And then we wanna have this. Wanna ro rotate it and flip it. And then it's gonna go right there. That work. No. Aren't you supposed to be able to make a new one here? Uh, paste. Save. Uh, oh, never mind. That's why we made it, because these guys only have the two slots once. Yeah. So this is a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 single lane wall station. I guess 5 single lane then. And then we'll just do that. And if you're interested in these, these blueprints, they're available on the drive down below in the comments. You can find both my my saves as well as my, my um, blueprints. Everything available right there. I'm curious how I want to do it with these. Because they don't work super far. 
I wonder what's what's the reach for these guys. You can cover the whole city with this. Close to it at least. Okay, that's actually really good. So probably what I should do is use this setup but with this station. How would that work? I do that. You are already not using that, so that's fine. And then we'll go... Oh, cargo station. Nice. Yeah, if we go with one of these guys right here. Not because we need the size. But because... It saves us a little bit of hurdle. I don't like these roofs. That one maybe? Ah, oh, that's the underground walkways, yeah. Let's use those just like that and then same thing here. Very good. That's a fairly large platform or station. I like which I do like so you're just gonna be your Nova Nova station I guess that's mainly for passengers and I'm still a little bit curious how I will bring in work not workers but uh, we're going to have to... Okay, even though this is a worker train... I think Java actually has a fairly decent reach. Yeah, not, not that good actually. I'm thinking if I could have... Maybe something over here eventually. To build up everything. I think we can probably expand into that at some point. For now though, I'm just gonna keep expanding this. See if we can get some more workers in here. And then is the question, where do we intend to have a workers set up? Maybe I want to go with that. Probably one of these other stations. Do these load double less quickly? But I'm not going to run a lot of trains. Maybe I will. If I run a big station here, then I will run a lot of trains. Right? So if I go with maybe one of these... We'll load slower, but we can get more trains into it. Why would I be able to get more trains into that than this? I wouldn't. Yeah, no, I would, because they can go over... Yeah. That's actually better. I think something like that, get rid of this station. And then we'll get one more of you guys. That is also going to sit right here, if we can get some, some, some uh, bricks. And honestly, that's almost too close as well. Yeah, I will be moving all of this down. But for now, I kind of just want to... Hold on, you got 60? What happened? Why did we get almost nothing delivered? Who's delivering bricks? Oh, it's these guys. Do we have bricks? Yeah, we have bricks around there. Okay. That's why they are not, not delivering. Cool. And uh, then let's get this guy. Don't him down, just down here somewhere. That is insanely close though. Maybe I will go like that instead then. This will only be for passengers, right? 
and then we'll combine these four into two. Which, let's see, they can go on any one they want here. All right, maybe I should have done this the other way around. These are good. I think I would have preferred. No, why would I do that? I'll just do this. Right? And they can go wherever they want to. Except for if they come on this guy, they cannot go. Okay, so we need one here as well. And if we have one there, do we need one here? I don't think we do. I guess we can, because they can actually continue straight if we do that. Then I have an idea. I think I want to try to have... I don't know if you can do that. You can. I will see if that's possible, because I would like to do something like that. But all the way up here. I want this city to be bombastic. It should be... It should be stupid. That's the whole point of this city. Too big. That's what I want it to be. Uh, so... If we go here and then we'll go... There. And then is the question... What if I do this? And then we're gonna do... Okay, yeah, this is gonna be crazy. Look at this. Look at this. We're gonna do this. We're gonna bring him around. Because I cannot drag these straight ever. And then he will go... Let's see if you are... Just going really wide here. Just like that. Oh really? That doesn't work? You serious? Why not? How, how far can I actually go without issue here? Maybe it means that they won't be able to walk on it if I do this. Okay, so far so good. Why is that not working? Like at what point do you decide that this is not not an option? Is it too too long maybe? What if we try this instead? Still too short. No, that's perfect. Okay. Nice. I like that. And then we'll redo it right here. I just hope that they can actually walk underneath. Which they can. This looks like some sort of maglev situation, and it's gonna look so cool when there's trains going on top of it. Yeah, I like this. I like this. It, it's completely unreasonable. It is perfect. Uh, we actually kinda wanna start one further back to get the correct angle here. Right there, and then across to that. And then this guy is gonna go to there. And for now, I think I'm just gonna do this. Might have to do something else with this route eventually, but for now, this is gonna be how, how it goes. And yeah, we'll combine two in the middle. Just nab these. Just 
like that. And then you are just gonna connect there. All right. It's been a while since I've felt like I've been doing something this good. That splits up the way you would expect. These can go... I guess 12 tiles, that's fine. I'm not gonna have any intersections around here, so... 12 tiles is perfectly fine. Even if we run 22 tile trains afterwards, which is probably what we're going to do here. There. And then this guy should be able to just build up his walkways, right? And we have extra capacity here, so if we needed to, we could actually unload more more people here than... Actually, no. This station is way larger than what this one is. So yeah, no. That's not an option. That's not an option, and I don't think it needs to be an option either. I think it's perfectly fine the way it looks right now. So, let's add these to here, and then a few of those outwards. And that should be pretty much it. And I have considered the idea that this will mean that we can only do this to connect to that station. It's a shame that these only have one. I wish these had different... I'm an idiot. They do have different ones. Okay. We'll be building different ones in the future then. I ain't doing that now. Oh, these roofs. What did I build? It's like a roof on top of the trains. Is that what I built? Yeah, I built roofs. Okay, this is what I needed. Maybe I should do that then. We can have roof on this station. That'll make it a little bit different to do the other one. I don't know what I think of that. I think that's fine. It kind of looks alright. Yeah, why not? Here, let's have roofs everywhere. <laughs> Running out of steel though, but that's fine. That's fine, we're burning a lot of money as well. Is there upkeep on this? No. There is upkeep on... No, there's actually not upkeep on these even. Okay, that's pretty good. I can actually decorate the way I want to. Yeah, he will be able to reach all of the houses around here as well. That is really good. I, I, I like that. Connect to you as well. We'll be having like a middle place here. That'll be pretty good. And then we will have... Some sort of production over here eventually. I think that that should probably be, be it. We kind of started a little bit of everything this time around. So uh, I guess that's... That is what it is. Uh, can we get this in here? Is that even possible? Not really the way I intended to be done though. So if I go, I would have to move that. Yeah, we could do that. We'd have to move this guy somewhere else. But other than that, we should be able to have one of these guys right here instead. And then connect this guy and this guy. But that's going to be in the next episode, I think. I, I feel like we've been... We haven't really gotten that much done, but I have a really cool idea about this, and I don't think I will be able to realize it in this episode. Then we'll be here forever. So I think we're gonna wrap this up here. And let me know down in the comments if you think this is gonna be a cool idea. I have not seen anyone completely levitate trains over a town like this. I think it's gonna be really cool. I think it's gonna be really cool. Let me let me know what you think. Hit that subscribe button if you want to see this actually come to a conclusion at any point. And uh, yeah, hit the like button as well. I know you guys like 
likes me transit. I do too. So I'm going to like my own video this time even. How about that? Let's click the like button together, okay? One. Two. Three. Four. Have you clicked yet? Five. There you go. Yeah, good. Thank you. Thank you very much. With that, I want to say, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.